Is success around the corner for you? Are you really leveling up? Well, in this video, we're going to be talking about five signs that you are growing and changing and five signs that success is coming. So hang on and let's get into it. Hey, you're back. I'm so glad to see you. This is Leslie, and I'm so glad you're here with me on this channel, on this video. Today, we are talking about five signs that you are leveling up because look, sometimes that journey is like really hard, right? Like, have you ever been trying to grow, trying to expand, trying to get better, and things seem to be getting harder or things seem to be getting more frustrating? Um, that has definitely happened to me. I know um, when I started to become even a writer, right? Like very early stages, I started out as a magazine editor. Things were not always smooth sailing, right? Like I had to learn a lot. So in this video, we're going to hop into it. Five signs that you are leveling up because I want to encourage you. It's not as bad as you think, right? Like we are doing better than we think we are sometimes. So Let's go. All right. So number one, five signs that you are leveling up and success is on the way, whatever that means to you, by the way, maybe it's wealth building, maybe it's something else. First sign, five signs that you're leveling up, you are speaking up for yourself more. Okay. So this is actually a big one. A lot of us, sometimes when we're not satisfied, we'll just kind of be quiet and let it go. But if you find yourself maybe getting more upset when things don't seem just, if you find yourself getting more feeling like you want to speak up for yourself more, feeling like you want to tell people what you really want more, that is a sign that you are leveling up because you are actually able to express yourself. You're actually able to say what you want, and that can be a sign that success is closer than you think. Okay, sign number two, you are no longer willing to accept crumbs. And like, yes, crumbs are great when you're eating a cake and it's the last few and you want them. But if that's all they give you on the plate is crumbs, nah, we don't want those. We don't want those. We don't just want crumbs. We want the whole slice. So if you're in a situation where you're at work, maybe, or when you're in a relationship or whatever it is, right? Whatever your situation is, and you're finding like, hmm, this is not exactly the dessert that I ordered. This does not exactly seem like the full meal. And you're starting to feel like I deserve better than this because, hey, you do, okay? Like if you have a dream in your heart and you're not getting there, if someone's not treating you right, if your boss isn't treating you right or recognizing your talents, huh, you probably do deserve more, okay? So if you're getting to a place where you realize, mm, I'm getting crumbs and I want the whole cake, I don't like this, that is a sign that you are leveling up, right? You're seeing what's possible for yourself. I love it, I love it. All right, number three, here we go. You are facing new obstacles and difficulties. All right, so I'm just gonna sit back on this one because I know sometimes when difficulties happen, we can think, oh my gosh, this is bad. This is a bad sign, I need to quit. But actually, sometimes when we're facing difficulties, it can help us move to a better place, right? So I believe in God and I'll just drop this right here. I have faith in God like for everything. He's gotten me through so much, it's, you know, bad work situations. I won't get into it here, but he's gotten me through everything. I'm here because of him. And so sometimes I believe that in my life, God has allowed certain difficulties to happen, right? To stir me up, to move me along, to keep me from getting too comfortable, right? Like I feel like sometimes things happen and it's like maybe if you're at work, for example, and you have some horrible work situation and you're getting really stressed out, maybe that's a sign like, hmm, you can level up. You can get a new job. You can become a freelancer. That's what I did. You can become a consultant. That's what I did. It's a sign that maybe you shouldn't be too comfortable and that it's possible for you to level up. So if you're facing increased difficulties, if you're finding that you're having like maybe even the same obstacles over and over again, right? That can be a sign that it's time for you to move on, to level up, to do something different, right? Because as they say, what's the definition of insanity? doing the same thing over and over again. So if you're having the same obstacles and not only that, but if they're starting to stack up, that can be a sign that it is time for you to move forward. I love saying that, move forward, but actually do it, take a baby step and then another baby step, move forward and start to level up. Okay, All right. So you are getting more comfortable with letting things go 
that you used to like. All right. So I'm going to explain this one a little bit, right? When we're leveling up and I've noticed this in my own journey. So for me to become a full-time freelancer, and basically that means, and I'm also an investor, but basically that means I don't have a nine to five job anymore. Right. And it was very scary for me to think, oh my gosh, in my case, I was leaving a six figure job to work for myself. There were many reasons I wanted to do that. Um, One reason was just to have more freedom and control of my time. So, you know, in order to move forward, we have to be able to let things go, right? You can't have everything. You only have two hands. <laughs> you can't hold everything. So sometimes if there's three things, you're going to have to let one of them go, right? So if you're getting to a place where you're feeling more comfortable being like, hmm, yeah, I think I could leave this job behind or hmm, I think it's maybe time to end this relationship that isn't serving me or hmm, I think that I'm ready to stop, you know, spending on things that aren't really helping me and maybe instead start investing. Mm, Yeah, I said it because I have had to make that decision too. Then you are maybe in a position where it is going to be time for you to level up, right? You're getting closer. You are getting there. And here we go. We're going to conclude with this last one. I'm so glad you hung in with me to the end. This is a good one, I think. When you are positioned to level up, right? This is a sign. Other people's opinions are not as important as they used to be. Uh Uh-huh. Yeah, I'm going to say it again. When you're ready to level up, all of a sudden, you're not necessarily as worried about what everyone else is going to say to you. You don't necessarily care as much about what everyone else is going to think, right? You're prioritizing you. You're remembering what you want. And that is a sign of someone who's about to level up. Because look, if we're going to have success, if we're going to build wealth, if we're going to become freelancers and consultants, by the way, if you have questions about that, let me know. I'm happy to do some videos on that content as well. But if you're going to do that, like, You have to kind of listen to your own intuition. You have to prioritize yourself and your own feelings. So if you're getting to a place where, you know what, my feelings matter, my thoughts matter, my desires matter, and you don't care as much about what other people think, girl, or whoever you are, right? You are in a place where you are about to move up and I am with it. I'm so happy for you. So that is all I have for you today. If this was helpful, if you saw yourself in this... This is amazing. I'm super proud of you. Super happy for you. Definitely like this video if it resonated with you. Definitely also feel free to subscribe to the channel if you haven't. And let me know, did you see yourself in any of these signs? Are you on the way there? Sometimes it starts with just, you know, one or two things, maybe three, and then you kind of move along. So let me know how you feel and cheers to leveling up. Let's do this. Talk to you soon. Bye for now.